leaving everything behind to travel the globe and never taking a single day for granted. You're in the good old days right now for the future. A few former residents of Greenwood are now globetrotting for life. And we're taking you along for their journey where they live, learn, work, and grow together. Thanks for joining us for Inside Indy. I'm Megan Shin. Imagine living, working, and traveling all in one for life. In the past 15 months, one Hoosier native family has taken to exploring as many international spots as possible. WRTV caught up with Adam, Linz, and their three daughters, Lily, Cora, and Harper, in Thailand. Their amazing story has taken them to 19 countries so far. We're about to set off on an epic adventure around the world. We'd always kind of dreamed about doing a big trip like this. About 15 months ago, we left Greenwood. But I guess it started about a year before that. A year in which the COVID-19 pandemic changed life for a lot of us, including the Clarkson family. We've lost friends and family. We almost lost Lindsay's best friend, Autumn. A birthday celebration to remember for one Indiana mother who is on the road to recovery after battling severe COVID complications. Family and friends held a fundraiser to help with medical expenses. She has been one of my best friends for a while and just being able to do this and raise this money for them. So many people are very generous and it's good. It was touch and go for quite a while, but after 100 days, Autumn walked out of the hospital on her own two feet. It kind of like opened our eyes and we realized that life is really short. It's like once she got better, we that's really when we like, I think started talking like, this is crazy, like life is so short. Um, we should, if this is what we want to do, we should do it. And doing it meant selling everything they owned, including their house. Our parents and siblings and everyone we knew was super supportive. Adam, Linz, Lily, Cora, and Harper embarked on the first leg of their journey around the globe in May of 2022. The first year, we had saved up enough money that we could go without working, so that was nice. But here now, we're about three months into the next, the second year, and we're trying to figure that out. It's a different, uh, <laughs> different beast now that we have to work and <laughs> yeah. do stuff on the road. We like to slow down and just kind of immerse ourselves in it a little bit more. That immersion means embracing all aspects of living life abroad. Here in Thailand, we love khao soy. It's like a really spicy uh, curry. Yeah, it's delicious. Creating experiences that go well beyond the traditional classroom. Where are we flying to? Japan. That's right, we're going to Japan. It's amazing. It's just watching them learn and experience these things and talk about them to their family and friends back home about what they're doing and just it's it's amazing to, to watch the world is also watching more than 16,000 youtube subscribers are following the clarksons every move from taking care of basics uh, to eccentric cafes in japan i don't know why on earth anybody would want more than 30 minutes that's big for me to stay here and even grabbing cheese curds in wisconsin you guys want to try them yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. right. The Clarksons are living each day in the moment. If you want to go see the Eiffel Tower, go see the Eiffel Tower. If it could be as simple as that. If you want to take an RV and drive it across the country, then take an RV and drive it across the country. You don't have to quit your job. You could do it in two weeks. You have two weeks of vacation, go do it. Don't waste your life because it's so easy to get caught up in that that day to day and before you know it, 10, 15, 20 years down the road, it's gone and you're going, man, I wish I would've done that 20 years ago. Thanks to digital producer Michael Hartz who helped tell the Clarkson story. The family says they want to continue traveling as long as they can. Up next on their itinerary, the Philippines. To follow along on the family's journey, you can find their website and YouTube page and this story on the WRTV mobile app.